People's Democratic Party PDP has been accused of sponsoring a fictitious report through the International Strategic Studies Association to mark the families of late Chief of Defence Staff Alex Bade and General Idris al Kelly. The Convention for Democracy in Nigeria, publicly known as CDN, made the accusation at a press briefing in Abuja. The national president of CDN, who read the group's statement, said ISA is being used by the PDP to churn out mischievous stories just to heat up the polity ahead of the 2019 general elections in the country. Politicizing the deaths using the report is insensitive and the PDP's attempt to malign the Nigerian government with the killings of Badi and Aikali is, is irresponsible even for a group of people that were long ago described as a nest of vipers. This desecration of memory of the departed is purely a prop for the purpose of elections. The intention is to instigate crisis in the polity and cause ethnic and religious strife that are all geared towards destabilizing the 2019 general elections. CDN described as insensitive the politicization of the murder of Bade and al Kelly by the opposition party, noting that it was a propaganda tool meant to sway the electorate to its sides. The group warned the PDP to desist from using the misfortune of some Nigerians to promote disunity and hatred against the federal government, the military or any other agency, and urged the relevant authorities to call the PDP to order over what the group termed PDP's lust for the blood of innocent Nigerians. We therefore warn the PDP in the strongest terms to desist from using the misfortune of some Nigerians to promote disunity and hatred against the federal government the military or any other agency. The accusation against the federal government will make the PDP feel like it is gaining political mileage, but the reality is that the suspects arrested for the killing of these former military chiefs and other Nigerians will simply plead innocence in court and point to the PDP report as indicting different persons for the crimes. What the party is doing is dangerous because it has a tendency to allow the actual criminals escape, knowing that, that these study acts will be dismissed as politically motivated killing. We are by no means asking the PDP to give up the mischief for which Nigerians know them. But we think it is time for the party to concentrate on anything left of whatever political value it thought it once had, and that if it still has any electoral value before the electorates. Saraki Secondus may wish to get a selfie opportunity with Boko Haram leader Shekau, but they should desist from trading off the nation's stability with lies from the peace of hell.